All right, welcome to Scrapyard Wars, where uh, Luke and I try to build the best computers we can with a set of guidelines and a fixed budget. So uh, this is our first episode. We're looking for a lot of feedback from you guys about what we can do to make these fun and interesting in the future. But for today's challenge, we are keeping it very simple. $300 cash, the very best gaming rig that we can build with a few rules. So number one is no monitor or other peripherals required. We only have to build the tower. No worker research can be pre-done, so you can't like go on websites or Craigslist and try to find things before or in between. Each participant gets a total of eight hours to actually find everything, and then four hours to build it, tune it, and benchmark it. And I'm not paying any overtime on this, so we are staying inside those guidelines. No leveraging friends, uh, social media contacts, coworkers, or anything of that sort. Overclocking is allowed. We'll be measuring performance of the machines using 3D Mark Fire Strike, Tomb Raider 2013, and Dirt 3. And along with the no peripherals thing, it's just a tower that you need, no operating system or anything like that. So let's get to it, shall we? Scrap Wars. Wars. <sighs> Here we go. You have exceeded your daily transaction limit. Please take your receipt. I see. Declined. Um, okay then. I'm gonna go inside. I have the cashola. There you are. Thank you. All right. Let's go, shall we? Good luck. I should have known he'd never fall for that. I'm fairly sure he's going to waste time going back to the office. I brought a laptop with me, so I will begin immediately. I really hope it's charged. There's a store somewhere in Vancouver. I think it's called Reboot. Um, it's a non-for-profit little store thing that kind of refurbishes computers and sells computers and does kind of cheap repairs and stuff for people that need it. And I think if I can participate in this contest and support a company that tries to, like they do really cheap computer repairs and I know they try to like, I think they do some charity giving computers to people and stuff. If I can help them out, get a cheap computer from them and participate in the contest, then that's doing many things well at once. So I'm gonna try and see if I can do that. I'm gonna contact them, figure out what their hours are and go from there. Now we're rocking. Here. Jesus. <laughs> All right, so should we start on, Red Flag Deals used to, be, used to be a haunt for me. I used to find a lot of good stuff there. The Linus Tech Tips, Buy, Sell, Trade, that Craigslist. Do you want me to call Anthony? Uh, oh, that, no, we're not allowed to leverage friends. And this is where the like montage music has to come in. Dun, 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 dun. Just buy a laptop. Hmm? That might be the best we can do. And then this guy also had a uh, hard drive for 20 bucks. Oh, he looks dejected. Does he? Yeah. Okay, good. Excellent. That means literally nothing. So an Intel Core 2 Duo with 80 gigabyte hard drive. <laughs> oh God, and two gigabytes of RAM. For 50 bucks though. So that leaves me $250 to get a graphics card. Let me give them a call. This is why we don't make TV shows. There seems to be a pretty significant drop in price once you get to Core 2 Duo range. So I'm looking for that because I think that'll be fine for most of the games. It'll fall behind a bit for sure on uh, Tomb Raider. Are they going to come to concede defeat? Where are they going? They're not allowed to take out more money. Oh, they're trying to film things better than just pointing the camera at me in the car. How innovative. Yeah, that seems unnecessary. Whoa, this could be... Oh, is this that same freaking guy? Well, he has a case. He has a CX-500 power supply, too. If I hear back from this guy, I don't think Lou's gonna think to check Kijiji. K 
Okay, 45, and then this is a combo, and then this is a combo. Whoa, computer cases with power supplies and other hardware. Phone calls only, please. All right, here we go. Hi, hi, you have a Craigslist listing for computer cases with power supplies and $10 or something? So do you have anything reasonably new with a 24 pin power supply and compatibility for a micro ATX board, like some kind of standard board, or is it all gonna be non-standard like Dell HP stuff? That's an Athlon? Oh, okay, that's a little older than I need. Uh, I'm looking for an entry level gaming PC. If you can just tell me what CPUs the systems that you have. I I'm very familiar with the, I'm very familiar with the hardware. I know what I'm looking for. I just need to know what you have. I can give you a contact with somebody who can tell you the parts you need. Oh, okay. That, that might actually be very helpful. Mm -hmm. What's your name? Uh, my name's Linus. Well, if you want to build a, a, a power, a gaming power, so then you need, you need a, a tough motherboard, you need fast processor, um, but you realize that one be Okay, um, yeah, okay, so... Today, what I'm trying to accomplish is today, I want to find my platform, so everything I'll need, and then tomorrow, essentially, I want to spend the entire time finding the best possible price that I can on a GPU. That's like my whole plan tomorrow. Pick up! I, I just found another uh, computer, same price, but it's actually $5 cheaper. It has a 450 watt power supply, that's probably fine. Uh, four gigs of RAM, so that's a slight improvement there. Four gigs of RAM, that's probably good enough. And then an E8400 again. I'm kind of surprised he hasn't just tried to like leave and go into some little computer shop and get them to give him a deal because of who he is. That was my full expectation the whole time. And then he put up <coughs> the rule that we can't use our influence. I was like, wow, because that's exactly what I expected him to do. So now I'm not sure how he's going to cheat. <laughs> I just know that he's going to. <laughs> I never cheat. I never cheat at all. You know what we should do? Is we should look really excited when we pull out. And, uh, and we should look like we're heading somewhere, okay? We'll give them a little, uh, a little farewell beep beep. You know? I don't even know how to use Craigslist. First stop is going to be the Salvation Army thrift store. This isn't a computer. I'm screwed. <sighs> that was bad. That was really bad. I hope Linus's time is not not going Continue better. On Langley Bypass okay. If I just throw the car under a semi, we'll be okay. We can avoid we can avoid judgment at the end of the at the end of the contest when we have no computer because there's no computers at thrift shops and Linus magically found something on Craigslist. I'm hoping that they don't have like computer savvy employees. So they might undervalue a certain tower compared to another one. Like they might price two of them at the same price. And one of them is actually clearly better. Fingers crossed. Oh no. Is this literally a clothing store now? Oh, we're gonna get kicked out anyways. Hi. Hi, this is the guy that's selling Hi, um, I'm actually contacting a few guys that are selling computer parts. May I ask which one? Uh, you got the phone number off. Zilbert. Uh, yeah, that's right. Hi. Okay. I'm just generally looking for everything right now. I don't have any of the components locked in and I need to get everything by about midday tomorrow. It's a birthday present. What would we be looking at for something like a Q6600 and a board? Oh, something like that. It's like $80. Still leaves me needing uh, case power supply. Do you have any like super cheapo stupid stuff? Yeah, case and power supply. Okay, I'm not worried about the case looking great. Uh, he doesn't see real well. Well, I can throw the power supply and case in too for the 200. For the 200? Um, you know what? I will call you back before the end of your shop time today. So I'll call you back in the next hour or so and I'll let you know if I'm gonna come by tomorrow morning and pick this stuff up. Sounds like this might be the deal that helps me out here. All right, thank you very much. Okay, Take care. Maybe it was worthwhile to listen to that life story after all. We might have just gotten everything but a video card with a $100 budget for a graphics card left over.
Okay, but that might be like plus tax because this is. Oh no. Well, let's hope it's not. I got an email back from the guy that I actually wanted to respond the most. This was the guy with the E8400 that had four gigabytes of DDR3 as well and the 500 gigabyte hard drive. It's not the greatest price, but that's an option. Uh, he's available right now, which is good. So I need to figure out if I can get a, what I can get for a graphics card for 220 bucks. And if I can get something good enough, which I think I can, I think I'll go with it. Linus speaking. Yes, I did. Oh, hi, hi. Uh, it's nice to meet you. I'm, I'm actually a fan of yours. Um, I was wondering, so what kind of price were you looking at for the hydro bumper? I, 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 okay. I gotta, I gotta be upfront with you. I can't leverage being me as a negotiation strategy. So you have to pretend that I'm not who I am. Oh yeah, no, I understand. Yeah, definitely. But so I don't need a water cooled card. I need an air cooled card, um, which right. means that since I. I don't have any budget left over for the rest of the system. I pretty much have to get an all-in-one liquid cooler for $100 minus whatever I pay for your card. Right. <laughs> so that's where I'm at. Okay. <laughs> I have got no leads on an all-in-one liquid cooler and I have to have this done by the end of the day tomorrow. Okay, oh, well, um, um, have you looked on Craigslist for like, cause there's another guy who's selling the Zalman cooler. Is there now? Pardon? Yes, is there? there? Is yes, there. there is the one guy with the $20 Zalman cooler for the 580. I see that. Because that would be just like an extra dollar, like 20 bucks on top of my card, right? Yeah, can you do 80? Oh, uh, sure, I, I, yeah, I guess I could, yeah. Okay, I could do can I pick it up, uh, can I pick it up today or tomorrow? Um, how about tomorrow? Can I come tomorrow morning? Um, sure, tomorrow morning. Yeah, sounds good. Um, where do you want to meet up? Uh, you're in Richmond, correct? Uh, no, I'm in Burnaby, actually. You're in Burnaby. Bur well, yeah, I can meet, like, uh, where, where can you meet, actually? I think I'm going to be in Burnaby anyway. Like, I'm doing okay. a bit of a, I'm doing a bit of computer hardware pickup stuff tomorrow, so. Oh, okay. Uh, I will be, I'll be around. So tell you what, why don't you just pick somewhere, somewhere safe near wherever it is you live, like a Starbucks or whatever and then uh, just let me, let me know. You've got my number, so if you just text me the address and what time works for you, I'll be there tomorrow morning. Sure. Um, awesome, sounds good then. I'll do 80. Sounds good. Okay, all right. All right, thanks. Thank uh, you. Can I, get, uh, can I get an autograph? Just wondering. That would be no problem. All right, thanks. I'll talk to you later then. All right, take care. Thank you, bye. Okay, we have secured a GTX 580 for $80. If they can get a slightly faster CPU than us, like maybe an 1155 Core i5 quad core, something along those lines, even if they have a slightly lesser video card, they might still come out ahead. If they get a similar video card, better CPU, then we're in real trouble. But basically this is gonna, I need to make sure our power supply has support for GTX 580. That's a pretty power hungry card. I wonder what they're up to. Hopefully spinning their wheels, finding nothing. All right, so I got the computer. Everything works. He booted it up for me. I got to inspect everything. It's fine. Uh, I didn't haggle him down anymore, so I got it for 80 bucks, which I think is fine. We'll have to see what Linus got, but that seems like an okay deal for an 8400 computer to me. The inside is really nice and clean, so I was happy to see that. Looks like he took good care of it, or at least took good care of it right before I got there. <laughs> Not entirely sure which one, but anyways. Um, <laughs> kind of baller RAM, I didn't expect this. Okay, maybe not actually baller, but it's gold plated, well not really gold plated, gold painted um, OCZ memory, which I thought was kind of funny. Um, there's the E8400, the fan, CPU fan and everything is in immaculate condition, which is great. Let me get this back in here one quick second. I thought it was kind of funny, the optical drive isn't even hooked up, but I wouldn't use it anyways, so. Uh, the power supply, though, is kind of like the most sketchy balls thing ever. It's a Powerlink 450 watt, but yeah, I don't know. No PCIe power whatsoever. Um, there's two Molexes, though, so I can adapt her off for that. So, I don't know. We'll just kind of have to see. So this will be my base platform. I'll see if I need to get a new power supply. Um, and then, yeah, we'll go from there.
This is really awkward because I've just made appointments with our GTX 580 water-cooled card and our cooler for it, which are totaling $100. But someone just accepted our offer for $100 on a 7950. So I'm going to do a little bit of research into overclocking the 580 and overclocking the 7950, but I'm going to feel like a real bad dude, but I might have to bail on those guys and take the better offer. The problem is that now I have to go get it tonight, which means I might have to take like the kids with me. So save on select Intel Core i7 processors and 730 series SSDs with instant rebates during Valentine's week, February 14th to 21st, 2015. Click now to learn more. Um, so, did we decide about going to get things tonight? Uh, yes. No, you can't. I can't. Well, that's very interesting then. I have a call to make. Also, you can't uh, do any more Craigslisting stuff. You have to six. So, get off the computer. So you're cheating already. I'm not cheating! What are you doing right now? Replying to a message. There was a... Okay, I, I had to, I had, uh, no, I had to do other stuff. I've been back here for a bit. I had to like record a voiceover and stuff. No, wh have I been here? Have I been working? Is there, is there actual? Oh, I don't know, Linus. Uh, See, oh, you uh, tell parents them. agree with me. Wow. Dicks. Hey, Linus, Terrence got that big 4K monitor. Can I have that now? No. <laughs> this is new 4K. And that's not 4K anymore. No. Sorry, I can't come down to get anything tonight, so I might have to pass. Um, if anything changes, I will I will give a call tomorrow to uh, to let you know. Um, if it comes to that, then if it's not too much to ask, maybe take the card out with you, and I could come to you wherever you happen to be, because it's a bit of a scavenger hunt situation I've got going on. Thanks. Uh, my number is three ten 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 Pizza Hut. Good night. There, I'm done for the night. There. That's all I'm doing tonight. <laughs> Next time on Scrapyard Wars, Linus gets a tetanus shot, Luke gets mugged, and Nick fights a dingo. Oh no, you stick off, you bloody dingo! Uh, none of that actually happens. Or does it? <laughs>